Why did I get halfway through writing von Habsburg and then just give up? Oh, I think my meddling made Bavaria independent. <laughs> Which means I can attack this child. Right, lads, welcome to the year 867 and welcome to Franz Joseph um, of the von Habs. I didn't do von Habsburg, they're just the von Habs. <laughs> well, you know, I'm just casual like that. <laughs> Why did I get halfway through writing von Habsburg and then just give up? Anyway, so today we're going to be trying to form Austria-Hungary as uh, quickly as possible, as early as possible. Uh, we start out as a count. We have lots of little counties though, so that's nice. Uh, we're going to be trying to take the Duchy of Austria uh, and then probably create our own kingdom. But I kind of generally want to see how much of the Austro-Hungarian Empire I can get, particularly in Franz Joseph's uh, lifetime. So we'll see. Why did I pick Franz Joseph? Well, firstly, he was iconic uh, in terms of being what the, the last proper emperor, I suppose. You can say he was also like, the longest serving. Uh, unfortunately, they don't have the ability to give him the, the amazing like beard, like beard without the chin part and the balding haircut. So I've gone for that. Uh, in terms of his traits, I've tried to generally base him off of history. So diligent, by all accounts, he was hardworking, stubborn. I mean, it goes without saying. Arbitrary, that one doesn't really work, but apparently he didn't really let like defeats phase him. And I think arbitrary is the closest thing that I could do with that. Uh, August, because obviously Austro-Hungarian Emperor, and whole of body, because that bastard lived a long time. First things first, I think we're going to marry this Giselle chap, just to get the extra stewardship. I always favor direct control, personally. And I think we're going to go Majesty Focus, not because it's the best, but because I think it fits. Um, I think we are probably going to be going down the diplomat tree. Give you an idea of the structure. Uh, we are under the king, or the duke, I suppose, of Bavaria, who has all of these little vassals here. So we're going to try and outgrow him a little bit. See we can take out. All right, let's get going. Oh, you idiot. Firstly, you must, my intrigue, not that great. But oh, you've given me too much control. Oh, no. Did I, do, did I get married? I did. Okay. Uh, let's get her to help me manage my domain. That gives us a claim. See, am I more powerful than you? I am. I also need to create the Duchy of Austria. Just because I'm the lowest rank right now, so I'm not going to be able to have a vassal. This puts us in an interesting position because we need to actually fight... Ooh, oh, that's annoying. Through marriage between Queen Mother and Burger of Italy and Count Arnold of München. As the spy master, surely I should be able to, you know, like, it does make life tricky. What's the declare war? Yeah, he's got 4,600 men. Okay, I have a plan. It involves murdering this guy and then hoping they get put as spy master of this guy's um, affairs because he's the one that's married off to the Queen Mother. So, sorry, mate. You really shouldn't have put me as your spy master. Okay, my dread is just going up constantly. It's now 43. All right, we got to murder him. Now, what did that do to the realm? I don't know what that did to the realm. Uh, you're, are you my liege? Okay, so it's just us? Like, it's just you and me. Okay, let's, let's fight you then. That's gone well. I mean, yes, this was the plan all along. Haha. <laughs> all right, this actually should be quite easy. Fortunate. All right, 100%. Excellent. So now we are independent. And King Arnulf is our new liege. Brilliant, because he's created a kingdom. We can become a duke. Just need 250 now. And then I can use up it off of my old liege. Up. Excellent. Right, now we are the Duke of Austria. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> all right, so now there's, hu there's Hungary. We need to go and conquer Hungary, which is going to be very tricky. We're a duke, which means we can start attacking people around us. Like this guy. But this province. Mine now. Well... It will be in a bit. Oh, God. It needs quite a while to siege. All right, I'm just going to take the loss on that just to siege this down. God, I'm burning through men. My, oh, Jesus. Please siege that down quickly before he has a chance to siege that down. Thank you. How much do I have in battles? Plus 40 yet? Uh, yeah, about plus 50. So, shorter truces, no penalty, penalty prestige. That's a really, really good trait to have. Already 29. <laughs> this is going very slowly. <laughs> All right, we need better, better everything. I'm going to ransom Count Popper. <laughs> so, you have no real... Power. So let's go after you. Oh, I think my meddling made Bavaria independent. <laughs> okay, yeah, because it's not the Holy Roman Empire. It's, it's just kingdoms. Uh, whoops. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Let's attack. Oh, he has similar. I don't really want to attack that anymore. Honestly, I think claiming the kingdom of Bavaria might be our best shot at taking Austria-Hungary. But I don't want to, like, advance too much west. You know, I've got to head eastward. He's also intimidated by me. <laughs> yes, the Duke of Austria. I can propose an alliance with the Pope. Yeah, all right. Do it. Allied to the Pope. Wonderful. Now, as my ally, can I have a claim on this child? Minus two. Buddy, buddy, surely there's something we can do here. He's with 38. Yeah, all right, fine. All right, now that the Pope is my pal, can I request a claim on this kingdom? Yes. Request that claim. He's given it to me, which means I can attack this child for the kingdom of Great Moravia. Which should, if I know my CK3, and I don't, 
Should make me a little bit independent. Which I have 99% already. All right, 100%. Enforce demands. I become a king. Put up the uh, Von Habsburg dynasty banner. This weird dynasty banner. And then another Von Habsburg dynasty banner. Okay, we're now independent. <laughs> you just allied someone else. Uh, okay. Okay, we're going to use you to fight the Hungarians. Oh, did my wife die? I pay 100 gold for her. She helps me manage my realm. It's a very expensive raid. Okay, now we can sort of try and conquer Duchy. Force vassalization can do that, but I need a lot more prestige. Ooh, holy war for the Duchy of Bohemia. I think doing that's a great idea. Do that. Uh, not let him take me out. Thank you. Because inevitably he would have stolen someone important. Also, I'd like to point out I've only had girls. <laughs> Four of them. Four daughters. <laughs> Horrible to fight, but we're going to have to fight him as well. Force demands. Okay. Now, call in my ally. Bavaria, come into this war. Pope Innocentus, come into this war. I can ransom you for 30, please, because I'm in debt. Okay. Uh, and I have a lot of territories now. 15 out of 8, to be specific. Is that another daughter? Okay. <laughs> Faction created against me. Yeah, I'll sort all this out in a sec. Hey, <laughs> gotta call some people into this war. This is, uh, yeah, it's getting a bit dicey. This is fine. I was only 300 troops. All right, uh, I really need to get out of this war uh, as soon as possible. So would you like to wipe peace? Yeah, I'm not fighting this any longer. Okay, excellent. We have Great Moravia. <laughs> over 10 years in debt. What do you mean over 10 years in debt? I haven't been in debt for 10 years. Now, my other plan is to go to the Pope and beg for my oh no i don't have enough for anything all right that's 2000 troops uh i need the bavarians to uh, come into this one and uh yeah handle this please there we go now do you hate me still no all right well we make no money uh which sucks so let me increase the vassal taxes i can't because we don't have plenary assemblies i hate playing this early sort of start all right planning my next moves it's got to be this right glory i mean Habsburgs. Right? Oh, great. Now Winfrieda has, has been transferred to someone else. Oh, God, she's a concubine. <laughs> kind of insulting if it's just you. 115 men. Really? Yeah, why am I fighting you? You're defending him. You're defending against him. Don't fight me. Yeah, there's the war done. Okay, good. There is no reason for you to fight me. To the point where I'm going to load that again. I kind of need to wait for this war to finish. I mean, you're minus 91% away. Attacking that duke in the holy war. So I just need to stay out of it. It doesn't make any sense that I'm hostile to you there we go it's done see there was no need to be hostile to me at all oh god my wife's dead that's like my oh no all right cecilia getting hit i'll take the prestige hit i need you to help manage my realm please my entire administrative structure is based on having a wife that's good at that sort of stuff not it's not the most tenuous of uh of situations. I don't know if I accidentally declined that call to arms. Uh, you want to sort through of, uh, There's a 5% chance of me flying. Let's do it. Oh my god, did it work? It was a 5% chance. Oh, yes. Oh, what? You, how did you go free? There we go, 100%. I only get these two places now. I was meant to get all of it. I don't know how I keep on getting weaker. I conquer more territories and I just keep on getting weaker. Right. I don't need 100 gold that badly. I can ransom this guy. That's nice. I'm going to give this other provinces to my son. I, sorry, he's dead. He died of old age immediately as like, I took my wife's side. <laughs> it seems suspicious. I'm gonna get a pet cat as well as my pet dog. Lovely. Oh, great. My, my cat killed my dog. I can't believe I've, I gave these people their lands. I just, I gave it to them. And they're immediately revolting. What a miserable kingdom this is. Oh, I fell in love with my wife, apparently. That's nice. It's such little money. Nice. Good win, guys. I did nothing. Can't even invite you to court. You're, you're his wife. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Can I have her back? My daughter is a concubine. You've had a miserable life, you poor thing. And you're slow. <laughs> She's callous, craven, humble, and slow. Oh, what a miserable life. Yeah, they're all just a bit strong. I have to be a paragon of virtue. I don't think I'll be able to get that with this character. Can I leverage my alliance with the Pope somehow? Are we allied still? Yeah. Look, you've got 3,000 troops. <laughs> His levies are so much bigger than mine. We've got a really good commander. <laughs> no one knows what's going on. Like, how many people are you war with? What? I don't know. Okay, now I'm fighting the Corinthians. Why? You allied to the... Ra yeah, you are. They have almost as many troops as I do. And my troops aren't, like, particularly good. My son learned Serbo-Croatian. Supplies going. Use the defensive territory to my advantage. Murder some troops. Rinse and repeat. What? You want me to sell might? I'm not selling my cat to my wife. You told me you wanted to get rid of it. I like how CK3 is like, oh, I'm dealing with a holy war against Rab, trying to handle the state, allying the Pope, making sure that everything's going as well as it should. And then immediately, like, there's interpersonal drama at the same time. It's like a really strange, like, Sims thing. Maybe I should play Sims. <laughs> is that something you want to see in the channel? You want to see me play Sims, do some, like, weird stuff there? It'd be fun. I haven't played Sims in years. All right, two more provinces. Damn! Number of nights plus one. That is filth. 
That's actually really good. Okay, we now have a border with him. He has one, two, three, four, five, six allies. I mean, sure, I've got five, but I'm the Von Habsburgs. That's allowed. You have, like, it's just a filthy amount. All right, what's this Holy Warfare Kingdom business? Paragon of Virtue, right? I have to be Paragon of Virtue. Love to fight Bavaria and, like, take out the Duchy of Corinth. Ooh, weakness. Look at it, 4,000. <laughs> oh, God, these tribes are ridiculously strong. I reckon we grind out this uh, Paragon of Virtue stuff. Probably an idea. Means pilgrimage time. Going to Jerusalem, boys. Go dedicated pilgrim. Oh, it's got us halfway there. Let's uh, seek indulgences. Yeah, I think grinding out the Paragon of Virtue and then taking the Kingdom of Hungary by force like that is probably a good idea. Who doesn't like me? <laughs> Everyone loves me. That's great. What about my kids? My kids will love me as well. This kid is great. Trusting, diligent, temperate. Oh my god, look at those stats. Damn. That is great. Oh, it's what a... God, I'm so happy with that kid. Because usually in these kinds of videos, uh, I stop uh, when my guy dies. What? You've become Slo Slovin? You're my heir. No. Change him back. All right, Hungary's getting their ass kicked now. Still, I've got to wait for that power of virtue stuff. I'm trying to sniff out weakness anywhere I can. And to be blunt, there ain't no. Oh, my wife's dead. Oh, he'll just become my duke. Okay, brilliant. What, who'd I murder? I murdered that long ago. That long ago. That was so long ago. I murdered him so, like, that was... Like, oh my god, I, I've completely forgot who I murdered. Dynasty Legacy, renowned name, of course. Oh, knight effectiveness, is that only 100%? Sucks. Because, like, we have a few knights now. Dude, my son's ginger, but he's, like, he's got a magnificent hair. Hey, another cat! All right, I do need to figure out what's going to happen on success. Kingdom of Bohemia will go to my son, but it's not created yet. In order to secure the succession, I th think we know what we're going to be doing. Ah, uh, child murder. Why did you marry her? Oh my god! Look how good his traits are, and he married someone with zero in diplomacy and zero in martial and just... Not lustful, sadistic, and vengeful, and melancholic. My boy, you're so much better than that. Call me a rowdy lion heart. Yeah, no, I'm not doing that. My daughter died. Is that the... Oh, the Queen of England. You're now a spouse. You're not even a... A... a, a concubine anymore. I don't know who you are. You're now Taltos. What the... <laughs> got kidnapped all those years ago, and now this is just this. Oh, great. My daughter's a jester. She's also a valued warlike courtier. Oh, gonna have to murder this kid. Also, I I'm losing all my allies. Because they keep dying. Wow, uh, you, that's a lot of allies. That's, uh, wait, hang on. Like the Austrian flag, you can't do that. Oh, my friend Eagle is dead. Everyone's dead. Right, I've learned the Magyar language. It's useful for when I... I'm the kind. <laughs> Franz Joseph the kind. Wonderful. His kid's also quick. Looks exactly like his father. I mean, it seems a bit unfair, but I'm, I'm going to raise all my troops to help out anyway. All right, who am I fighting now? Oh, my God. So France has just collapsed, basically. Wait, I'm fighting West Francia. Absolutely not. You can handle that. Can I seek indulgences? Can... All right, we're inching ever closer. I filled out this entire tree. So, uh, I suppose I'm gonna go Bellum Justum. Dread gain. Go down the Bellum, just quickly tip Bellum Justum. And the spouse of mine heart is dead. Yes! Let's find you a good spouse. <laughs> He's Amazonian. You're not gonna lose anything. Yet somehow I think that this guy's gonna destroy this woman, but still. What's my dread like now? 51. Okay, what's my dread like now? So it's 50. It's not bad. I don't know what my natural dread is. It's 15. <laughs> All right, go on a pilgrimage. We're going to go on another one to Jerusalem. Yes, there we go. Right, now. It's what we've been waiting for. Holy War for Kingdom. Here we go. Austria-Hungary, lads. We've lost every single ally we've ever had. It's not going to give me an alliance for some reason. Bavaria, can I ally you? Arrange marriage between my son and this chick. You wouldn't accept. You don't want an alliance. You little bitch. All right. Who could we ally? Marry myself or someone. West Francia. Oh, people used to be lining up to ally her. No matter. So we declare the war. West Francia's over here. I was planning on bringing them on my side, not fighting them. But, uh, there we are. Alright, I'm gonna call in all these little guys to war. I don't lie, I thought I had more, uh, more troops than this. <laughs> what are you declaring war for? You're at war for that. You take that. By all means. I don't wanna mess with this. Um, Bulgaria, I just need... Well, Wallachia, do you have many troops? No, I just... Well, why can't I ally the Byzantine? Grandson, no... My son, no. Can I ally the Abbasids? Nope. Hazaria? No. Granddaughter? No. No one wants to ally me. That's really sad. How about you? This is really sad. I'm gonna go for unyielding defender. Defend our troops a little bit. I actually don't want them to win in this war, so I'm gonna go in and murder the troops. I don't mind you winning this war, but if you could do it quickly, that'd be great. Don't siege me down. Oh, Winfrieda, no. She was infirm, slow, and she had a horrible life, and she's dead. You killed my daughter? Oh, died in captivity. Oh, yeah, well, I mean, yeah. Gotta wait for this to resolve itself. There you go. You should have won. Thank you. Okay. 
So now I'll take the rest of this land. Thank you very much. I'm also going to call in West Frankia. Who am I allied to then? Wait, my grandson has a claim on the Byzantine Empire. What? Get over here, bud. Why? What do you mean? All right, Kingdom of England. That's good. Let's do that. Alliance formed. Call to war. Thank you. Okay, why are you doing here? You're attacking someone else. What wars are you involved in? Fending against me. So why am I at war with you? You are attacking Ungvar. Oh, I actually do have to fight you. I really hope the English get here soon. Damn it. That's what I was meant to do. Bellum Justum. <laughs> So it was a cheaper war. Oh, well. Excellent. Good to see. There are so many people swarming over Hungary right now. I'm infirm. Oh, no. I need to finish this war. Where are the English? Why is Ungvar in this? <laughs> How many wars are you involved in? Oh, the Hungary looks like a child's first attempt at an art project. Dying. That's fun. To be fair, this is the main thing I don't like about um, CK3 is the messy wars. Like This guy's not allied to him at all, but he is defending against me for some reason. It doesn't doesn't make much sense. I right, see so we can capture someone important. 99%. Can we, can we get an extra 100 somewhere, please? My troops are starving. 100%, wonderful. Now, that just puts us into more pain. Because whilst we do have the... Oh, we don't. We're not at war with anyone. <gasps> I thought we'd be at war with someone. Okay. Now, I did want to form my own kingdom, if you recall. To actually call it the kingdom of uh, Austria-Hungary. <laughs> That did not work. We have 32 out of 6. All right, let's, let's speed this up. Right, that's hungry secured. And that's my cat dead. Sucks. Austria hungry. What else did Austria hungry have? Let me bring it on the map. Okay, so they had up until like, look at the map on my right hand side. They had up until... So we roughly have the eastern borders. Mm, we kind of need a bit more Poland up here. And we need to focus on Bavaria and, and sort of this area. Okay, we're getting there. A couple more holy wars around here will do it. Right, well, let's clean up the center of our lands in the meantime. Okay, you just instantly raise more troops than I thought you had. That's fine. It's, we still have more. This is very inconvenient that you did that. That's coming down to the wire. Jesus. All right, let's see if we can capture someone important. Okay. All right, there's a lot going on. Um, my realm has exploded to violence. Uh, okay. <laughs> this is going to be a slog. All right, we are on death's doorstep. So I think it's finally time for us to... Uh, yeah. Can I, like, I don't know, murder you? No? Okay. My, my friend. We should leave this guy as our only heir. Now, let's sort this out. Immediately factions. Okay. Now, this character is skilled. He's not as skilled as my father. Um, he's also possessed, which doesn't help. He can have more direct control. So, we can have these two promises. Well, these are tribal holdings, so I don't really want them. All right, let's give these away. He's also... Slovenian. Let's get some chivalric dominance going and then we can use these extra knights that we have. Well, let's holy war for this duchy. First act as a new king. Consolidate our realm. To be honest, we kind of need better troops. Uh, so more men at arms. We can maybe afford it. We do have like a thousand. Uh, so I should probably be building stuff. Oh, cool. We took a daughter and that should be the end of that. Disband all. These lands should be really stable considering that I myself am Slovenian. Excellent. We've got a Dutch, uh, Dutch claim? claim? No, a <laughs> press claim on a duchy. <laughs> My Dutch claim. Okay. Uh, which means we can declare war, which is going to be quite useful. So I think we just go ahead and do it. You're a fortune builder. That's pretty good. There you go. Uh, can, I, can you a vassal, please? Grant vassal. This guy. There you go. Jeez, this guy's already 46. <laughs> How old were you when you died? 88. Oh my god. Oh, obviously I've got to go for all of Smyrmia, right? Don't know what that is. It's just that one province, but I just spent more on it. <laughs> there we go. Take that. Wonderful. Oh my god, look at these like one province duchies. Okay, well, let's get started. Where are you going? <laughs> you're sending me to hell is what you're doing. Let's stamp this dude. There we go. Half of you go siege on that. Half of you go siege on that. And that should be the war done. Um, anyway, excellent. That's another singular province taken. Right, I've got myself a crown. It's very important. It's an excellent crown. <laughs> Chuck that on my head. I think that worked. Excellent. All right, I just need to grind out uh, any sort of prestige-based things to get enough prestige, obviously, for a uh, for an empire. Oh, I can just offer you vassalization. There we go. All of Steiermark. And that's what we need. 9,000. Who's he allied to? This Italian bitch. The Byzantine Emperor. That would help. All right, let's just go for it. <laughs> murder as many troops as possible so let's go over there take that and then you go and take i don't know it's one like this there's the 100 we will take that thank you right we can found a new empire <laughs> just in time to die but he is the emperor of austria hungary that counts. But in any case, boys, I think that counts. I mean, obviously, we didn't have uh, everything that we wanted. Um, we'd need sort of this area a little bit more. 
couple bit, bits and pieces. But for the most part, I think that's that's fine. I think that looks roughly similar. I'll take it. I'm counting as a win. So if you did enjoy, please do let me know in the comments down below. And please do like and subscribe. It really does help me out. If you have any other nations you want me to form or any other stuff you want me to see uh, to, or do in CK3 or that weird Sims thing I had, uh, I had planned, do let me know. Otherwise, I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Huge shout out to our patrons, most notably Charlie Demorel, Krilly, Flyerton, JDow52, Cargon, Xiaomi, Lewis Wright, Nicole's Christ, QA Shard, Redguard, and Shadow Singer. Your support means a lot, guys. Whilst you're here, you might as well click on another video. I mean, it's, it's literally right there.